What's up, everyone? Welcome back to Sekiro. Uh, since the last episode, just to kind of, you know, speed things up, I decided to work back to Ashina Castle. I think this is where I'm going to be continuing. The Lady Butterfly boss fight is looking pretty difficult. And I don't know if I have, like, the necessary HP to take her on. So why don't I continue here, see what we encounter, I'll see if I can't pick up a couple of more prayer beads. And yeah, then we'll go take her. I mean, I'm guessing it's inevitable. There's a lot of dudes there. Go to the Sheena castle. These are new enemies too, which is good. If you don't, oh, if this guy's coming this way. Hold on. There's a secret passage there. I thought he was gonna come over here. But hey, it's all good. If we're gonna stealth, we're gonna stealth. So I was gonna say, um, yeah, new enemies, which is already better than Neo, where there are no new enemies. I've, I have been playing Neo once again, just on my own. I mean, it's fun. I'm having fun with the game. It's just, you know, the faults I mentioned way back are still kind of, yeah, I screwed up, are still kind of valid. Oh, there's, what the hell was that? He's doing the Ichimonji. Okay. You're about to fucking guard break me. Oh, fuck. I'm on the wrong thing. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. These guys are tough. Holy shit. We're gonna resurrect. Because we have plenty of healing gourds. Shouldn't be carry that. Fuck. Alright, well, I know my mistake there. I didn't get a... You know, I was gonna backstab one of the guys and then one-on-one -on -one I can figure out their attacks. So yeah, that's gonna... It's gonna be our next plan of attack. I have plenty of anti-dragon rot stuff. And it doesn't happen that quickly, luckily. Unseen aid? Yes, I knew it. I just had a feeling that I was going to get on scene aid. This is a good chance to f figure out their attacks. They attack a lot, that's the thing. It's okay, again, one-on-one, -on -one, every enemy is hella more manageable one-on-one -on -one in this game. What the hell? Oh, it's one of those ladies. I'm gonna have to wait for her to, like, fuck off because she calls all the enemies in an area. So I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be in trouble if she notices me and just turn around. Oh, but that dude is coming by. Oh man, the price of stealth. There's one over there. We'll see if he... Oh, he won't come this way. This all good. This dude is... Wow, they, they notice you well. Like, they have more awareness than some of the other enemies. Secret passage. Oh. Kinda secret passage. Somebody noticed me. I think it should be okay. There's no way they're gonna be able to figure out that the boy is up here. No way. Absolutely no way. 
But yeah, again, yeah, they have way more awareness than some of the other enemies. If I can drop attack, this little bitch. God damn it, you've got to be shitting me. That's again the wrong thing. Oh fuck. I may I'm meaning to throw shuriken. Uh, that's my plan. Right, so let's get the shuriken out. I feel like if I have a chance I should critical that guy. Although I might not be able to. These two need to lose track of me, holy shit. I feel like they're gonna follow me to the ends of the earth. Alright, they broke line of sight. Yeah, you can do this. Uh, enemies break line of sight fairly easily. Okay. No way forward but forward. I'm not gonna let you call the other ones. Yeah, me carry this bitch. There's so many of them, holy shit. How, like, one is okay. How the fuck am I supposed to kill three of them? They're like Mikiriing and... Yeah, we gotta get the fuck out of here. Oh man, holy shit. At first I was like, you know what, yeah, that's not going to be too bad. Yes, okay. I carry this fool. Okay, they all, he always starts out with that, like, hilt. Nice. Thin the herd. What up, old lady? There ain't shit you can do now. Oh, there's another one. I like busting this place up. Okay, if I can... Did he... He didn't see me, did he? No, he kind of did. He's got a slow as hell, too. See, they always start out as soon as they deflect. Oh. They either go into the uh, Mikiri attack or that, like, little sword hilt. See, they always do it. But I don't know if that can be deflected. Yeah, the timing window for Mikiri is massive. Except when I fail to see the kanji. Alright. That's a kanji, right? I think so, yeah. ENB was talking about it. Yeah, again, I'm watching ENB's playthrough of this game. But only up to the parts that I've gotten to. Uh, you know, I'd hate to spoil anything for myself so how the fuck am I gonna do this there's no way cuz hmm <laughs> I think it's safer to go back and now that this place is cleared figure out some other kind of plan of attack this area is very involved can I already tell Oops. It's never mind me. Never mind me. Because those two dudes, they're like legit two dudes that showed up out of nowhere. I swear. It looks like there's no other way to go if I want to go through that guy. I don't know if I need to go through this guy. That's a problem. Let me see if there's some sneaky way to like... There isn't. Should be okay.
Is this guy like... I think he has different attack patterns. Yeah. Just wait for my thing to go down. Shit. Man, you gotta be quick. Game journalist. Easy mode is needed. Come on, die. Oh, thank you. Well. To say that I'm out of healing items would be... The understatement of the century. But we got through everyone. Except... There are two... Okay. Let's ignore those two. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, I think we can safely watch this cutscene or memory or whatever. The rejuvenating waters, what? Oh. Uh -huh. So they're like kind of interlinked, the kid and this water. I see, I see. Because that's like the whole point of Ashina, right? That their kingdom is kind of falling apart. And they are trying to like... Essentially create... Um, an immortal army. I think that's kind of the the lore, or kind of the main motivation of all the baddies. Who knows who the actual baddies are? I feel a lot better about doing this. Do you see? There's iframes in this game. See? Told you. People who doubt that there are iframes. No, there are iframes. I was getting ready for the Mikiri, but I was <laughs> accidentally dodging everything. Um, again, unintentional. But hey. If it works, it works. Why do I have a feeling that this is going to be a boss fight? This is like the most... <sighs> yeah, this is for sure. About as boss fighty as you can get. Ashina Ale Jinsuke Saze. Oh fuck. That does a lot of damage. Oh, this is gonna be fun. He's like. God damn it, I. What the fuck? Oh, this is gonna be fun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can already tell. This is. That's gonna be real good. Real good, guys. Damn. Lady Butterfly on one end. This dude on the other end. Holy fuck. Where am I even supposed to go? And there's the Spear Dude as well. Where I've already looted all the stuff with the Spear Dude. But I couldn't fucking beat that guy either. At least there's, there's a... At least there, there's a way to... Uh, retreat. Reduces vitality damage. Cool. Let's not let him get that. What what is this strike called? This is the Uchi Gatana, no? Yeah, okay. You don't get hit by both of them. Holy shit. Okay, that's a slash. Hey, he doesn't actually have a lot of HP, I just noticed. Is this a dodgy boss fight? Yeah, because you can like... Holy shit, he's fast. 
Looks like you take chip damage though. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, well. It's not as bad as... Yeah, we can resurrect again. Yeah, you need to jump that. He's not like stuck in some like weird pattern, is he? Because he keeps doing the same thing over and over again. Yeah. He dodged the wrong way though. I died. Oh, I knocked him down too. Well, then actually, that wasn't too bad. Yeah. You just gotta dodge to his. Well, to our left. We'll give this one more try. That Ongo Sugar, I don't know how much it helped. It seemed to have helped. I just gotta watch out for the sweep attack he does. I thought it was a Mikiri attack, but no, it's a sweep attack. Okay, let me use another one of those sugars. So I have plenty of them. Is this a boss fight where you actually have to dodge? I swear I was blocking there. Oh, that... No, I shouldn't say that. That's... Whenever I say that... Holy fuck. <laughs> he can wipe you. He can wipe the floor with you, absolutely. God damn it. He's very difficult. Just by the amount of sheer amount of damage he deals. I am using the right thing on Go Sugar, right? Like lower vitality. Let me just check what I have. Uh, we have increases attack, reduces vitality damage from physical, posture damage reduction, suppresses sound. Yeah, I'm using the correct one. Okay. Yeah, he deals chip damage through my attacks as well. You have to be like very, very precise with your dodges. What the hell? Lock on. Oh, shit. I can resurrect, can't I? Yeah, yeah, please tell me. Yes, yes, yes. Is he dead? Holy shit, that wasn't actually that difficult. Alright, got a prayer bead. God damn. Man. Scrap Magnite. I'm gonna have to go out again. To the roof. To the roof. One sec. Let me just get the eel liver. Capable of banishing lightning. Offered at the Ashina clan altar. What the hell? <laughs> Greatly reduces the amount of damage received from lightning attacks as well as the shock status abnormality. Lightning is a force of the gods. Eels, while small, are relatives of dragons. Damn, it's not lore I've heard before. Even a god's force can be suppressed, though probably not for long. 
Hanging scroll of an old blade, ghosts once lurked the lands of Ashina. The ghost lightning was of the fountainhead gods, unstoppable by normal means. Avoiding ground, reverse the lightning. Ride the lightning. Oh, lightning reversal. If one is standing on the ground, lightning surges through them, making movement impossible. But if one is struck while in the air, the lightning can be dispelled from the body. Damn. Wish it worked like that. I'd actually go out in storms. But, you know, I'm not a ninja, so... Whatever. There's probably some... There's gonna be... What this is telling me is that the next... Uh, boss or next area is gonna involve a shit ton of lightning that's if I had to guess if I had to guess that would be that would be a guess I would make alright so we can continue here uh, but I'm gonna be honest with you I'm a little bit drunk with power all of a sudden so I kinda wanna go and try the spear dude you know you know with spear dude I can give him a drink. Um, okay, upgrade prosthetic. A flame barrel. I don't have enough for shit. Oh well, whatever. Then I keep getting these, uh, what you call it, these upgrade materials, but, and I always think I have enough, but I never do. It's all good. All right, so we need to go to Ashina Reservoir. I know, again, I'm kind of all over the place with how I'm playing this game, but yeah, I just want to take every challenge on its own. There are so many areas to go to as well. I haven't even been across the bridge in this place here in the reservoir. I don't know where that leads. And of course, we can still go down into Ashina Castle. Haven't been there either. Oh, hello. Man, these poor dogs. Compared to their other Souls game counterparts, they really did them dirty in this one. Oh yeah, that's where we need to go. Yeah, they really screwed the pooch, so to say. Alright, this spear dude is a bitch and he's gonna go down. Let me tell you that. Not even these ogre fools will be able to stop me. Actually, I think there's a rifleman down here somewhere, if I remember correctly. Yeah, there he is. Just pick them off one by one. Well, that didn't exactly work out. Forgot there were this many. Most of them with guns. Oh wait, you can roll like that? <laughs> that was quite a combat mechanic. Oh, I tried to Mikiri him. Don't even ask me what the hell is going on. Took some damage. It's okay. I think those are the ogres. Coming up to greet me. I'm gonna sneak off. One by one, they're okay. But multiples of them are a little difficult to take out. Believe me, I've tried. Not even sure these are ogres. Fuck. Okay, yeah, 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 let's not, let's not play, <laughs> play with fire here. Uh, that's what I'm doing. I 
can't believe they saw me from that far away. There's no way. They have good eyesight. You gotta commend them. They've been eating their carrots, you know. Actually, I was reading about how that rumor, you know, came about. The carrots improve your eyesight. It's some like World War II thing. Look at them retreating. It's kind of funny. You know that they're going to get backstabbed. You know it. Just got to relocate in a way as to not get spotted. Just bam, bam. Stab both of them. We'll be all good. Shit. Motherfucker. Yeah, I'm getting fucked up. This is real bad. This is real bad. Uh, I thought it was easy getting to the spear, dude. But it's not. God damn it. I fell. <laughs> I didn't know there was a... I didn't know there was a... Pothole there. Yeah, you come on over here. I'm guessing these guys are probably weak to shinobi firecrackers. Uh... Yeah, this is not gonna work. As in... I'm not gonna have enough healing items for the spear, dude, because I've used all of them. Fuck. Okay, I'm going back. Never mind. <sighs> I think I might go longer in this episode because, man, that's fucked up. I'll well, not travel. Rest. And I still don't know if I, I can actually kill him. I mean, that dude looks insanely difficult, that spear guy. I don't know. So many places to explore. Yeah, because we never went beyond there either. I thought I could count as a... Apparently I've forgotten how to play this game. I beat a boss, come on. I can do this. Or can I really? These are idiots. Wrong shinobi tool, but whatever. Let's give this one more try. There we go. Now we're off to a better start. So. Okay, go along here. We got a plan of action here. Kill this thing. Kill this dude. Yes, kill this dude.
I've been kind of noticed. It's okay. Yeah, just turn around. Told you. See, they listen to my commands. My things are going way better. Holy shit. <laughs> this is annihilating. These things are so fucking weird. I don't like them. I don't like them. Sure, I'm sure they're based off of some, like, Japanese folklore monster. I don't know what are these. These are not even yokai, are they? I don't know what they are. Is that a dude? I don't know if that was a dude. Oh, hello. Shit. Looks like there's no option but to fight. These sword guys should get over here first. Get over here, a la Scorpion's Chain. It's freaking out. What happens if I... Holy shit. I did not know I have a combo follow up from that. Very lenient. I, that's what we were talking about yesterday uh, during my stream. That how lenient the parry windows are in this game or the deflect windows or whatever. Just like straight out of the way. That wasn't even intentional. Okay, there's one more poor schmuck. There was a dude there. Who's gotta be like the most unaware enemy in this entire goddamn game. Pretty much everybody got slaughtered next to him and he's just chilling over here. Okay. I'm gonna go around this way. Just so that I can stab the dude in the back. See, my idea is that even getting it down to, you know, one hit point is going to be difficult. Not hit. Oh, fuck. No, no. Oh, thank fuck. There's a... Okay, I think the reason this is here is to prevent idiots uh, in the tutorial from... Not even tutorial, but the first level from killing themselves, but came in handy here. It's what happens when you don't pay attention. Where is he? There he is. Was that here before? Yeah, yeah, it was. Never mind then. He doesn't turn around, does he? I don't think he does. Apparently this dude is difficult as fuck. Wrong tool. Holy shit, look at the amount of stamina damage he deals. So yeah, there's a... This guy is tricky because... Shit. I'm really trying... I'm really trying to Makiri him. Good thing I have more HP because... Fuck 
me. That timing though. Okay, I'm dead. Okay, just get out of the way for that one. can't do it oh man that one has like massive amounts of you got to do it right at the end the makiri fuck i was doing better than before i will admit that you know just to kind of praise myself a little bit the problem with this guy is that you got to go through so much to get to him ah uh, it's not easy it's not easy I kind of want to, I kind of want to continue. See this, the problem is that this dragon rod stuff halts me so much. Like, because I don't want to dragon rod anyone. It always kind of makes me, not second guess, but kind of second guess. Whether I want to go this way. Or like continue grinding an enemy. There's this place as well. Haven't explored this place at all. No grapple points? Seriously? The question is... Can I get enough? I can't. Holy shit, he has a bell! the hell that's a grab isn't it yeah okay, just be careful can't say the weapon is not creative Doesn't deal as much damage as I thought. It's one, two. Oh. Gotta actually dodge it. Fuck. He's like, wow, this is really. I like the sound effects. Good sound design. Man, the instinct of dodging. There's no way you can block that. Yes, you can. I'm dead. It's all good. It's all good. We got resurrect. One, two, three. Eat shit. Wow, that was that was actually kinda awesome. Scrap magnite. Is that magnetite or magnite? <laughs> that, that was sick. I'm gonna be honest with you, that was sick. Really, really good sound design. With the bell kind of just clanking around. Alright. Where is this place? It's a new sculptor's idol, obviously. Abandoned dungeon entrance. I'm gonna rest, that's for sure. Oh man. So yeah, again, that's the thing. Maybe it's just like my psychology that was psychology, man. We're getting fancy here. That with this with the threat of this dragon run, I know it doesn't do anything, apparently. 
I'm always hesitant to, can you know, grind a boss, which is what I should be doing, really. Okay, yeah, the memorial mob. We the impure cannot turn a blind eye to anyone. Interesting. I'll do that. Mask fragment. Fragment of an old dancer's mask. Uh, he sells a prayer bead. Nice. Ooh. The boy sells a prayer bead. I got a shit ton of these. Yeah, why not? I'm all about them prayer beads. For now. It's like, you know... It's like grinding for HP or leveling up HP in Souls. The first playthroughs, you do it a ton. And then slowly... You kind of... Wane yourself off of it. Is this like undead? I think they might be. Okay, this is weird. This is a weird area. Well, not really, but... Okay, that's an NPC. I was wondering if there was an NPC or an enemy. Surprise! What the hell? Is he dressed as... Looks like he's dressed as a cat. <laughs> it's a Khajiit. Yes. Fetch quest. I'm guessing. Dojin. Wait, isn't Dojin the... Oh, no, that's Dogen. A worn and blasting letter from Dosaku, the surgeon in the abandoned dungeon, required one tough man, preferably a strong samurai or a young large soldier such as a member of the Taro Tube, must be delivered unharmed. How the hell am I supposed to do that? Oh man, like, these are undead. Or something. Oh shit. Get off of me. Get off of me. It's a kiss of death. I'm guessing these guys probably don't like fire. Yeah. Wait, can't I? Got the Ichimanji. This is a cool area. Pacifying agent. I think I've had this before, didn't I? Red lump. Consume to gain red eyes and reduce flinching from enemy attacks, but also prohibits the use of resurrection. Huh. That's an interesting kind of trade-off. Uh, before we go and continue, there's a Sculptor's Idol. I'ma hit it. Sculptor's Idols are really frequent in this game. Cool. Didn't even spend too many resources. Holy fuck, it's dark here. Yeah, it's water. I don't know, do we want to continue here? How am I supposed to get like a Taro Troop member unharmed to this guy? There must be like some way to capture enemies. Oh yeah? Fuck you. Oil. Oil. Great. Not exactly the hot treasure I was expecting. 
Oh, and this brings us back to the start, doesn't it? Maybe it doesn't. Okay, more pacifying agent. Ichimonji is good against these guys. I think. It's been working out so far. Oh, and this does the loop around. Okay. What a strange area. I'm guessing there's more to this place that I'm discovering. Yeah, there's the dude. It really feels like there is... Oh, he got back up. Yeah, these guys cannot die, can they? I wonder if that works in this game as well. For anyone who's, you know, Sekiro exclusive. Uh, hasn't played the other Souls games. Mashing R2 and L2 gets you out of grabs quicker. At least it did in the other games. So this is like some new, completely new area, right? Fuck it, let's go on. Even though I can't see shit. Yeah, there's dudes here. Huh. Like proper soldier dudes. Akko's sugar. It's not much I can do, but fight them. Cool. This pacify they're really pushing this pacifying agent. Uh I kinda know what it is. I've heard about it. Apparently it's like Frenzy from Bloodborne. And you need it to... I think it's an insta-kill. Just like in Bloodborne. Which is a little bit shitty. Because... I feel like these insta-kill statuses are never that fun. Okay, let's kill the rifle dude first. He's gonna blast us. If we're not careful. So far, pretty linear. I'm liking this area. Operate mechanism. Hey, we got ladders. I mean, elevators. What Souls game wouldn't be complete without an unrealistically, like, out of time elevator? Okay, this one kind of makes sense because it's, like, water based. I'll w I will give them credit. Okay, this one is... Give you a pass on that one, game. What the hell? Well, we're getting somewhere, that's for sure. What the hell? Thought there was gonna be more. I thought he was gonna say... Turn back the old hunger. Wait, the old chaos hunger still? Is that what they say? I think it is. Ta what? Those of the sample team. Okay. Uh huh. I think we can handle ourselves. We have a tendency to respawn. This is always a however. Is is this warning me that I'm not supposed to be here? Is that what's going on? I feel like that's what's going on here.
We will pray for your safety. It's the least that we can do. Holy shit. I really have a feeling that this is the you're not yet supposed to come to this area warning message. Sampu Temple, Mount Congo. It's a completely new area. Well. There's a floating. And there's already a split in the path. Okay, before we get too far ahead of ourselves, there's stuff to do way back. I feel like before I start exploring a new area, I should finish the old ones. Um, yeah, this was an interesting episode. I feel like we made good progress. Beat a, I was going to say a couple of bosses, but I realized it's only one. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up here. Thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this episode of Sekiro. Yeah, we'll continue next time. Thanks for watching and see you. Peace out.